Hello, so DJ Corn here, and today we are going to talk about the, the Mega Bar 50 RGB RC. Excuse me, I just said the name of the light. I was gonna say that. Well, I know you were, but I never get to say anything. No, please don't turn it off. Please don't turn it off. Please don't turn it off. Fix that. So, anyway, like he said, we are going to go for the Mega Bar 50 RGB RC. <laughs> Okay, so here it is, the Mega Bar 50 RGBRC. Now that's a really long name, isn't it? Okay, so I'll break it down for you so maybe you can remember it. Now, Mega Bar, that's the series of the whole lighting system. 50, uh, let's just say 50 means half the size of the bigger one, okay? And RGB, let's just say, like always, RGB, red, green, blue, uh, RC, remote control. So that's just a little simple way to break it down so maybe you can remember the name. It sounds like a bunch of mumbo jumbo. It doesn't mean anything but all those letters really do mean something. So it's a pretty affordable fixture. It's perfect for anything like up lighting that you want to do. It actually comes with this little remote control that is um, controllable up to 30 feet away. Um, you have your blackout modes, you have your strobes, you can do color mixing, all that. And um, if you had two of these fixtures, and one was a standby, and one was you were wanting to do some cool effects from the remote, but you didn't want one of them to change, um, I'll show you a little trick to fix that. This fixture has a total of 125 LEDs. It's got 24 red. 54 green and 47 blue. With all the LEDs fully on, it only takes 18 watts of power. It also has a 40 degree beam angle, so you get a really wide wash area. It has 1 through 7 DMX modes, so you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7 channel modes, and that gives you a variety of things that you can do with it. The 7 will have everything from the strobes, the built in colors, and everything, and your one channel will just be all the lights on and off. So before I take this thing apart, I'm going to take you down a tour of the outside of it and show you a few cool features of this thing. Okay, right here is your IEC power connection. And over here, um, right there is your microphone. Um, here's your four button digital menu right there. And um, that little feature I was going to show you earlier, it's right in here. You just select through and you find where it says IR and that's your remote control and uh, if it says on then your remote control will work on this fixture when it says on and tell it to turn off and that means your remote will not be um, functionable on the on that fixture so that's just a little helpful trick on the lights that you don't want to um, receive your IR signal from the remote okay over here is um, your DMX in and your DMX out three pin and then your IEC power connection out and you can have 44 fixtures in one daisy chain. Well, having said that, let's take it apart. Okay, so we have it all apart and uh, there's not too much but it's got some really, really nice quality stuff inside. So I'm going to take you and we're going to go through here and show you some of the things that they put inside and hit away. Okay, so um, here is your power in, your IEC power in, and there's your main leads coming into the, into the system. Um, right here is your um, auto switching power. So you can plug this thing in anywhere in the world and you don't have to worry about the voltage. It will automatically switch it for you. That's a very excellent, excellent feature. Okay, so here are your other power leads. Um, right there is your ground. Uh, and if you notice, the wires will travel along right here in a single line and come out on this one. And that is where your power out for your IEC power out connection is. 
right here is your onboard menu here is the uh, main board for that okay so uh, there's your mic you can see where your um, microphone connection right there is um, let's see over here that's your um, connection for this board um, travel along here and this right here is a um, connection for your LED strip all right so uh, you can plug it in right there it also has another connection right here which is your IR sensor and that is back in there that right there and uh, so if your LED strip happens to ever go out which is very unlikely you just slide this thing right out pop those two clips out slide your new one in pop them in and you're good to go um, like to say that we're using high quality 10 millimeter LEDs there's your um, IR sensor right there right on the front and uh, that's where your uh, let's see right there that's where your wires connect to it and um, that's it the mega bar 50 RGBRC boy it kind of looked better before I started unless some of you you think it looks better like this anyway thank you for watching up close I'm DJ corn we'll see you next time <laughs>